Hello friends, today we're going to make an egg sandwich. It's very delicious and um, it's very healthy for you too, all the ingredients. And um, if you're a close friend, you might have already heard about this recipe. I really like it. It's very easy to make and very good. Okay, so I hope that you like it too. So let's start. So I'll tell you just like the basic ingredients because it depends if you're making one sandwich too for the whole family. So you need bread. Personally, I like to toast it. It's to my taste. You don't have to, but it's up to you. You need tomato, avocado, hard-boiled egg or eggs, and uh, oops, salt and pepper. Okay, so let's begin. Okay, we start with the avocado. Um, I showed already a video of how to cut avocado, but if you don't know, okay, you go in the middle here. With this hand, you grab it and you just go around. Okay, you have to be careful because a lot of people have cut their hands cutting avocado. Especially when they go to this part when they smash the knife in here and twist it. But we don't need that to do that today. Okay, anyway, so we start with avocado. I use a spoon. Um, it's easier for me that way. Okay, because what you need to do is you grab your avocado and with the spoon you kind of uh, scratch it out. So it's kind of already smashing at the same time. And this avocado is kind of going to be like our mayo or butter. So we take it all out. At the same time with the spoon, we can go around and take all the avocado out. There we go. So now we're just going to spread it here. Like I said, this is gonna be kind of like our mayo or butter that we normally put in our sandwich. Normally, I use half of avocado, but it's up to you. You can use more, you can use less, okay? Okay, so that is the first part. Now, the hard boiled egg. Uh, being honest, that's kind of like the longer part, boiling the eggs. So normally what I do, is I boil a bunch of them at the same time and um, use what I need to use and the other ones just keep it in, in the fridge so for the next time it's just easy and ready to do. I don't peel them so when I put them in the fridge I put them in a closed container and, um, and keep um, the shell so when I'm gonna use them I peel them I kind of feel fresh okay okay so here we go so we cut now the horrible egg And it's up to you. I mean, normally I just use one per sandwich, but the same. If you want to add more, you can add more. It's all to taste, whatever you like, right? So we put our egg in here. That's step two. Everything in there. And now we're going to use our tomato. Step three. So my tomato is already washed and dry. And now I'm going to cut it. Uh, there are some tomatoes that are bigger. So maybe you just need like one big slice. You put it on top and that's it. This tomato is not that big. So I might cut two or three slices. Put it on top. So kind of keep our egg in place and it's not falling <laughs> or going around. You can see now, and I add salt, salt to taste. You can put it whenever you want it on top of the tomato or with the egg or with the avocado. It's up to you. It's up to you too if you want to put salt or not. And we have pepper. That is optional too. If you want it, you add it. If you don't, you don't have to. I'll just put a little bit to taste. And that's it. There you go. I'll take a picture. Hope that you like it. Enjoy!